Hello and welcome to Book Reading with Sammy. Today we are going to read a very special book. It's called Totality, an Eclipse Guide in Rhyme and Science by Jeffrey Bennett. Remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Totality. Today's the day. It's finally come. I will see a diamond on the sun. It happens somewhere almost every year, but rarely is that somewhere right here. So this time, it's October 14th, 2023, that we are going to watch the solar eclipse in the USA. That is so amazing. We are so excited. We are talking a total eclipse of the sun. An incredible sight, second to none. In an ancient times, it caused quite a fright when people saw daytime turn into night. Look at that. It looks as if it's nighttime, but no, it's just daytime. The sun is covered, but by whom? Today we know it's a great cosmic dance and predicted movements far in advance. That's why we know that Saturday is the day. Three dancers there are Earth, Moon, and Sun. When they line up, the eclipse has began. Look, the Moon is between the earth and the sun and that's why we cannot see the sun. This idea will become much more clear knowing earth orbits sun once each year. While moon orbits earth showing phase after phase repeating each 29 and a half days. Almost a month. These orbits are tilted, which helps to explain why eclipses do not form a monthly refrain. An eclipse of the sun can only arise when new moon and two orbits all coincide. So there's the sun, here's the moon, and here is the earth. Even on a new moon, we see the solar eclipse. On a full moon, we can have the lunar eclipse. This happens just about twice every year. At each of those times, an eclipse will appear, but only for those who are in the right place. And it's not always total because we are dealing with space. So sometimes we get to see a partial eclipse, maybe a partial lunar eclipse or a partial solar eclipse. But very, very rarely can we see a full eclipse. If the moon is off center or slightly too far, your eclipse will be partial or just annular. And even when all is as it should be, you must be in the shadow for totality. See how it goes? Within those green lines, you have to be in the exact space to see the full solar eclipse. The shadow is round and not very wide along a thin path. It rapidly glides. So if you would like to see a total eclipse, find a good map and plan out your trip. When the day comes, the daylight will dim for more than an hour as actions begin. Animals will start to act very strange. Patterns of light will gradually change. So animals will think, oh, it's already nighttime. It's time for us to go to sleep. So they will be heading home. You can use eclipse glasses to protect your eyes 
but don't take them off till the moment arrives. So be very careful when you look at the sun this Saturday. You need to have your goggles. That's when you will see the brief diamond ring. Then the corona, a spectacular thing. I'm sure you all are very excited. You will look up in awe to see stars in the day until much too soon. The moon's out of the way. So be there with clear skies and all is now set for a breathtaking view. You will never forget the end. Enjoy the solar eclipse.